I don't know what's going on with Grand Theft Auto V not coming out on the PC. It could be Rockstar being a bag of dicks and saying, you know, oh, well, we didn't release Red Dead Redemption for the PC, so we'll just give them the finger twice and say no Grand Theft Auto V for you, and we will deny PC the probably the best game of this generation, I'm guessing, because fuck you, PC! You are too powerful, you are too much better and too different from the consoles, and we don't like you, and you're pirates, and you're bad, and we hate you. Or... We're going to get it. The issue is, either way, PC gamers are going to have to wait 15 days for an announcement from Rockstar. Not even to have the game confirmed. Just to have the game, like, made an announcement of so we know what's going to happen with it. Or maybe we just get teased and strung along by Rockstar. And it's like, why? Why all this hatred for PC this whole generation? You're better than me, therefore I hate you. The hardware's better, therefore I hate it. The hardware's different, so therefore I hate it. It can do more, so I hate it. You can custom build, so you hate it. It's easier to fix, so I hate it. I hate everything that isn't my precious console, and I'm a fanboy, and my sphincter pucker level is so high I'm going to implode. I don't get it. I don't understand all the hatred we get. We don't, we're not pirates. We're not all pirates. We're not all bad. You know, we're good people. We're good. We're human beings too. We want our games. I wanted to go home yesterday and play me some Grand Theft Auto V. And I couldn't because it didn't come out. Because it doesn't exist for PC. You know, my only two theories are basically either it's a fuck you from Rockstar or they discovered some kind of catastrophic bug like all their development kits had ATI graphics cards and now it doesn't work on NVIDIA for whatever reason. Or like with Grand Theft Auto 4, when Grand Theft Auto 4 first came out, you actually couldn't run it on anything that had more than, I think it was like 2,000 megabytes of uh, VRAM, which is most 2 gigabyte graphics cards, which is like all we have now. So... I mean, what I'm thinking is that either they're saying fuck you or they've discovered some kind of catastrophic, terrible bug. Actually, I have a third theory. My third theory is that because of all the issues with Games for Windows Live, maybe all this time they built the whole game for PC around Games for Windows Live and now they have to strip it away because of all the issues they've had, all the backlash that's having, how Microsoft is trying to kill it and get rid of it. You know, we either got, we got a technical problem, we got Games for Windows Live, or we've got a fuck you. And right now... With the way it's been, you know, Rockstar didn't say we will confirm GTA 5 or we, were de we will debut GTA 5. It's just we will announce our plans for GTA 5 on PC. That's a little bit threatening to me. That points a little bit towards, you know, we're going to get the finger. We're just going to get, you know, like, I'm asking, I'm going to Rockstar and I'm saying, hey, please, can I have Grand Theft Auto 5? And Rockstar, like, puts their hand on their chin for a second. They look down and they sigh and they're like... How about I give you the finger and you turn around and play Grand Theft Auto 4 and go bowling with Roman, fuck you. And I don't want it to be this way. Like, I don't want to go and buy an Xbox. I don't want to go and buy a PlayStation just so I can play Grand Theft Auto. You know what, Rockstar? Fuck this. I'll take my business elsewhere if I have to. I can play Sleeping Dogs. Sleeping Dogs is pretty complex and cool and it has good graphics. You know, it's a... Uh, it's a decent game. It's not Grand Theft Auto V, but graphically it looks a hell of a lot better. You know, it, the gameplay is pretty similar. You're just, you know, not the world's not as big. It's not as customizable. But hey, I can go to United Front and I can play a kind of similar game and I can give them my business. And I can buy their DLC. And you know what? That's what I'm going to do, except I already own Sleeping Dogs. I'm going to go play Hotline Miami. Have a good night, guys. This is fucking bullshit.